Hello everyone, it's Kay here again. Following the video I did recently um, suggesting wedding invitations and how to make them on behalf of Handy Hippo, I had a private message from one of the ladies that watched asking me to make the heart embellishment bow that I did um, for the wedding card that I showed how to make. What I'm using is the Italian Options Satin Ribbon 18mm 18, sorry, 16 millimetre width. I've cut off a good length between 12 and 14 inches and tapered off the ends as you can see just for a little bit of extra manoeuvrability. I'm using this colour in the hope that you'll be able to see what I'm doing a lot easier. Um, I've got the little heart embellishment here with the bar running down through it. This is ideal for this size of ribbon but needless to say the same practice would follow if you used a, a larger buckle embellishment. So to move on you need to fold your ribbon not in half but you just need to have one tail longer than the other and you need to pass it up through the embellishment and then over the central bar of the embellishment and pull that through and you'll see that that sits quite nicely in the centre of the heart shape covering up the central bar. Now this is not as easy to use as the organza ribbon which obviously crushes down a lot smaller than this does but it works in exactly the same way what we're aiming for is to make a bow so you'll see I've left the longer of the ribbon which is to the top of this piece and I've got the shorter tail at the back. I've turned the work over I'm now going to twist that bottom tail oops, and add hot glue to that to keep it in place. I'm then going to make the bow to the other side and just push that down there until I get the opportunity just to line up and make sure that the two parts are almost identical in size. You can be forgiven for it not being perfect, it is after all handmade. Once I've established where I want that to be, I go back to the back of the work again and twist that piece of ribbon like so, pop some more hot glue into the centre of the ribbon and press it down. Do be careful because these hot glue guns are quite vicious if you get the hot glue on your fingers at this point. Having done that you then see that we have two tails hanging down underneath the heart. A little bit of manoeuvrability will get it exactly where you want it to be. This is a double sided ribbon so it really is quite unforgiving for this kind of work and then you take your tail with the crease away from you cut up at an angle to give the swallow tail and the same on the other side fold your strand of ribbon in half snip up toward your finger and there you have a really very very pretty bow embellishment with the heart on the front. So I hope you find that helpful. It is quite straightforward to do. All the work goes on at the back of the bow and it really is a question of lining up, pulling them into place, preferably whilst the glue is still warm enough for it to be malleable. And there is your little embellishment that, that looks if I put it on the corner here, it really does look quite effective and would be a nice embellishment on a card or on your work. 
Thank you very much for watching. If I need to try and make this a bit clearer, do let me know, but hopefully you've got the gist of how it all comes about. Thank you for watching. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.